turn, two, three. One, two, three, volume out, around, two, three, volume out, around, two, three, hold. Very nice. Okay, so we're gonna go over the waltz routine and we're gonna find some of what we did last week and this week and we'll talk about how we're gonna move forward with all this stuff. So, first of all, we're gonna work on just a three-step turn, which we started like this and we're just switching with volume. So the idea is if, if we don't do the turn and we're here with each other and we just come in and out, that everything we do, if we were to go forward into the feather steps like we've been doing in class, we use that same volume, that same idea, favoring each other. If we do turns like we just said a minute ago, we want to use that same formula. It's in, it's out, we switch, we go forwards, whatever it is, we just maintain this, this um, open posture, really big frame, isolated, everything held. So the way that we used that tonight was a little bit more advanced. We did it in shadow. We did it very formulaic. The idea is to go forwards and then favor the right. So we're just going to do one favor right, one favor left, one favor. Then we have the turn out. And the turn out flows because of the way that we're using shape back and forth. So once we rolled out, then we went into three side sets. We did one, two, three. We have this nice shape. This shape is very similar to this one. But because we're crossing, we've just changed just a little bit. Now we walk around. I use that same volume, same volume, one, two, three, and then here we have a hold. Okay. So we'll put this together now. So we'll go from feather steps into the turn, and then we'll go into our, uh, our back spot turn. So if we start on the right leg, we have right, two, three, left, two, three, right, two, three, turn, two, three, one, two, Three, volume out, around two, three, volume out, around two, three, hold. Very nice. Then the, the other thing that we did tonight, and I'll take it from where we left off, and this is the whole point. We did a hesitation here at the end. So now I'm going to meet Barb with in a twinkle. So I'm going to go outside partner here. As we separate, we're going to close my gate. Then we switch into our waterfalls. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, and then we're gonna close it up. Two, we are back into a box. We're basically whatever we're doing, whatever level we're doing. Yeah, so let's do that one more time. We're just gonna show you real quick the waterfall, okay? So from here, we started with this hand tonight. We just do step, side, close. We go step, side, and close. And again, step, side, and close. We take the hand up, we shake, and now this time we're just gonna take the hand up again, we're gonna close everything up. Close everything to frame. Yeah, so this time we'll do everything together, and then we'll leave it alone for tonight. So we'll start from feather step. We're gonna do a little advanced, we're gonna do what's called a natural, open natural whip it. So you're gonna see something kind of fancy. We're gonna go to the right and shut. We're gonna go right, two, three, left, two, three, forwards, two, three, turn, two, three, one, two, three, open, two, three, around, two, three, one, two, three, around, two, three, hold, we go into waterfall. First we do twinkle, then we go into this one. One, two, three, one, we're gonna go ahead and close it up for now. Yes, we go waterfall one more time, this direction, so one, twinkle, and now we separate. We'll do more waterfalls this time, over here. One more after this, then close frame, and we are done. Nice. Good job. Yes. More fun with waltz. Two weeks. Happy birthday, go team.